hello. Hey, babies. Speak to the people. Speak. Now you're going to be quiet. <laughs> they say, Mommy, we don't feel like speaking today. I know, I feel the same way. Um, because, man, today is today. I know. Oh, gosh, I can hear him right now. Why are you out there? I had to go off and blow some steam, baby. I had to get out here and blow some steam for a minute. I'm going right back in. Outside is not a good place to be right now. And I, even though I'm out here, you know, I'm rebellious that way. But uh, it's just kind of like one of those things where, okay, if I go outside, even amongst the radiation and, and the virus, mainly the radiation, I can just like, you know, sit on the ground and just chill and get some healing from the ground because I really want to go nutty on some niggas right now. And I'm not, and when I'm saying niggas, I just, that, that is a, a term that is not color specific because I'm talking about dastardly, ignorant, stupid people who actually come in all colors. I mean, you know, the, con the country right now is run by one of the biggest niggas, you know, ever. Uh, when you look at the term, when you take out the color and look at the term for what it is, oh yeah, he's one. But there are a lot of people out there, some too. And this is what I need to get off my chest today. I need some people to get the fuck up off my dick. I really do. It's almost like you make your whole living trolling Pisces. Like you know Pisces and Pisces do this and Pisces do that and you don't even you know you don't even know what the fuck Pisces is about. Let's be real. Every motherfucking sign is jealous of Pisces. Why? Because we're a combination of all the signs. A combination of all the signs. We're not just one sign. We are twelve signs all in one. And when we have our shit together, oh my God, the jealousy, the hate, and the shade that comes out. And for some reason, when you see it coming out, you can't accept it. You still got to look at it. You still got to find flaws and find stuff that's, 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 that's just wrong. And really what's happening here is people are projecting themselves. They're projecting their own insecurities. They're projecting their own dramas. They're projecting their own bullshit on somebody else because I guess you feel so little about yourself that you want to try to tear somebody else down. All I have ever done was live my life. I have helped many people that most people don't know shit about. I have done things uh, and help people that most people don't even give a fuck about. You don't even know how deep my pockets can go or how deep my feeling, uh, I can't even say the word philanthropic, uh, giving away money to different charities or helping different charities. You don't even know how deep that goes. There's no need to even talk about that shit because it ain't none of your goddamn business. But what I don't like, and maybe it's something about the day, maybe it is that whatever that decadent, I told you I don't get off into the specifics of shit like this, like where the plans are, and da 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 I just know what I feel. I go about my feeling because Pisces, more than anything else, we're about feeling. But keep in mind, my midheaven is in Aquarius, so my shit is larger cult as Fuck. And right now, I want to like just body slam some people because I'm so sick and tired of y'all. And Bay would say, Why are you letting these people get to you? And that's why he's one of my greatest teachers, if not my greatest teacher. And I've had some wonderful teachers. I've had, I have been blessed with, uh, I was born with two of the best teachers uh, 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 a soul child could ever have. My mom and my dad. Oh my God. Doesn't get any better than that. Some of y'all have had fucked up parents. That ain't my fault. That, that, that. It ain't my fault. That's not me. I had great parents. If you, if your fucked up parents fucked you up, why you want to bring that shit on me? Maybe you need to go and talk to your parents while you're going on the inside. Maybe you need to try to figure out, you know, what is going on with you. Why you feel like, why are you like that? Why do you have so much jealousy? Why do you have so much hate? Why do you want to project on people? So I'm not projecting on anybody. I'm just giving my story, giving my life. And people try to dismiss it like it's uh, delusional or illusional. You know what? You're going to find out by the end of this year. You really, you really are. I don't have to prove shit to you. I don't have to show shit to you. I told you before, my life is not TMC. It's DMT, Divine Mother Therapy. I don't give a fuck. I don't, you know what? Mm. Mm. 
I don't want anybody and everybody in my business. That's a problem with some of y'all. You put too much of your business on Front Street. If I put my business on Front Street, it's only to help other people, not to like tear people down. Except when I'm doing some shit like this and I have to clean up house. I have to clean some shit. I got to get some shit off the plate. I got to get some shit off these double D's because some of you motherfuckers have gotten on my nerves for the last goddamn time. And this is pretty much the last time I'm going to address it. Because after that, I'm going to like really stay focused. Because he's got me focused. And it's hard. He's got me focused. Now, who am I talking about? Again, it's none of your business. If you're really, really following me, you get it. And if you don't get it, you don't get it. So, you know, it doesn't matter. But the point is that I get it. And this is the whole thing about this and about now. Do you get it? Like I get for the fact that I know it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful out here. But again, you see, like, you know, ain't no people around me. Ain't no people around me. I know, baby. See, ain't no, ain't no people around me. But it's more than just the coronavirus. It's the radiation. The ra- You see these trees? You see these? You see, I, I, I come out here way too many times and I see how these branches are breaking down see this means nothing to you because you bitches be sitting on a couch all the goddamn time and smoking up all the goddamn time whether it's a blunt or a jewel or whatever the fuck whether you're drinking your ass away whether you're sitting there just like trying to relate to people you trying to relate to people you trying to tell people about their lives when your own life's fucked up how about fix your own life how about you want to show people how to live better and be better be better yourself stop trying to tell people that's why i don't do readings and shit like that that's why i tell you my stuff is not reading i don't do readings i do channeling i've always been a channel that was a birth thing that was a birthright that's something that just runs in the family so you know i don't have to look at a card or look at you know or 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 or, or look at the straw i don't have to look at all that shit i just be I am that I am and I just be. But when others are not like that, they get, and they profess to be like that, ooh, they get jealous when you walk that walk. They talk that talk, but they really don't walk that walk. They walk that walk from inside of the house. They walk that walk from on the motherfucking couch. They walk that walk by throwing shade at everybody else. But when you look at their life, their life's not that nice. Watch them closely. Watch their steps. Watch what they're going on around them. Really? And for some of you who want to even get up in my sauce like that, what is that song that says, why would I throw away a dime for a penny? What? Shit, if you can't even do as good as I am, why the fuck am I going to even be fucking with you? I am a military brat. I wasn't, I mean, I'm, this is no, this is not a, it's not a brag. It's just a fact. I wasn't raised in the ghetto and shit like that. I was a suburban kid, man. Both my parents were uh, in the military and professionals. My dad had his own job. He had, he did his own thing when he came out of the military. My mom was a nurse. So if I'm talking about stuff like vaccines and stuff like that, I'm not just talking about what I got from somebody else's channel. I'm talking about shit I know, like from the books, the medical books, the medical journals I was reading when I was seven and eight and nine years old. I was doing more stuff at seven, eight, nine years old than most of these people have done all their goddamn life. But you want to throw some shade on me. You seem to want to make an effort of throwing some shade on me. I know, baby. I know. And I'm hearing them. I'm hearing like, why are you letting this get to you? Because he, people get on him all the time. You know he does a lot of shit just to fuck with your heads, right? He does a lot of shit just to fuck with your head because he knows it gets your attention. He's got this thing about attention. I get it. That's his business. That's his thing. I had to like, you know, like I had to check myself on that because I didn't get it. I didn't understand it, but I understand it now. And the problem is some of you all don't understand it because you think I'm playing boo-boo the fool and that's not it at all. It's all a game. It's all a game, which he plays it well. I don't play it so well because I'm a little bit too transparent. And when you know what, you know, when you cut me, I believe. When you stab me, I feel it. He has been stabbed in the back and cut so many times. I don't know how he does it. it. It hurts my heart. It hurts my heart to the point that, you know, I will stab somebody else, you know, when they stab him. I'm, I'm ride or die with him. But you know what? First and foremost, let, let's get back to me. I'm the type of bitch that would knock a motherfucker out. I wasn't always like that, but maybe I was because I remember when I was young, I think I had like, my cousin was like about seven. I might've been six. And I asked her what her name was and I asked her three times and she didn't say. And so I slapped her. I mean, it wasn't nothing personal in my mind, but I get impatient when people agitate me. 
And people are trying to agitate me on some dumb shit, on some lying shit. Maybe you've ran into some fucked up Pisces in your life. And I will be the first to admit, Pisces can be fucked the fuck up. I know when I'm not on my tip, I am fucked the fuck up. Because, you know, when I am in my depression and shit like that, man... I mean, I look at I look, I look at the people, I look at my closest ones around me, and I have thanked them so very much because I've said, I don't know how you put up with me after my husband's murder. I don't know how you put up with me after my husband's murder. From being one of the first people in radio, I've gone through, I've worked at so many radio stations where I was like the pioneer at all the stations. Like, it was like, what I used to call it, I used to call myself, uh, what you call the, the queen of new startups, new stations. I was at new startup station, Foxy 99, Fayetteville, new startup. You know, went from D103 to Foxy 99. Here, I'm trying to stay. This is what the team, this is what team does. The team, D103, they didn't want to hear what I had to say. When I said, you know what, well, we're taking our audience for granted. Some station's going to come in and eat our breakfast, lunch, and dinner. They didn't want to hear that. Lo and behold, here comes a 100,000-watt powerhouse. I wasn't even going to talk to the owner until the sales manager who went over there, who was our sales manager, said, just talk to the man. And you know what he showed me? He showed me all the resumes and tapes of my team that were trying to get with him. But I'm up here sticking with the team. That's what I've learned. You can't stick with motherfuckers, man. You gotta watch motherfuckers. Because people say who they're on your team. They're not. They're just for themselves. And I got so much hate and so much jealousy just because I was one of the baddest, if not the baddest bitch on the air. I'm still a bad bitch on the air. And I don't mean to say like I'm bad bitch. I'm a bad bitch. You know, that's... I was a damn good. I was I was damn brilliant and still brilliant at what I do. So School Cafe, man, I've been doing that stuff since 20. 2007. 2007. I've been having my own show since 2007 on internet radio. I was one of the startups of internet radio when it first came on the scene. Power 93 in Richmond. Power 93 in Richmond, man. We, my mentor, Mitch Faulkner, and I, we, and the team, the dream team, Aaron Maxwell, Tony, oh my God, Terry, we were the bomb. When I interviewed Vanessa Williams and she said that was the best interview she ever had, and that was my sister, I was glad. When Flavor Flav came through and he was cussing out every other station, but he didn't cuss at me. Because, you know, we got that Pisces code coming in. Y'all don't know the stuff I do. You don't know my credibility, but you should check the receipts. Because I show you the receipts, but you don't, wanna, you don't want the receipts. You want something. You want something to make you feel good about yourself. So you want to find some flaws that's not there. I'm here to tell you, bitches. I'm getting ready to cut all this energy so off. If you, if this makes you feel good about yourself, to hate on somebody that's doing great, and you know it doesn't, because deep down inside you feel really bad about yourself. So you want to find something bad about me. But you know what? If my success makes you feel bad, then I'm going to give you so much success. I hope each and every one of you bitches choke the fuck on it just choke on it just choke on it oh Val that's so mean is it is it as mean as actually getting to know a person and seeing their actual value or worth instead of dragging that person because your life is fucked up because you haven't lived see I got cut off memory got cut off maybe I was ranting and raving too much maybe that was a synchronicity maybe I need to re focus but let me get that last line out just because I don't know if it got out I hope that my success make you motherfuckers choke since your life ain't all that it needs to be that you want to find somebody like me and want to drag talk about you know Pisces you don't know me you're scared to talk to me you won't call me you won't email me you want look at me directly you want to talk to me directly why because you might learn something that I'm the shit that I'm everything I say I am and you are not and you can't handle that you can't handle that you think I'm delusional you think everything I'm saying is delusional you think the stories I tell are delusional they're absolutely true just like you think all his stories are delusional they're absolutely true Here you've got two people who are telling you the truth and showing it to you in front of your face it may not be completely all that you think it is but we're showing it to you in your face but you know what go ahead on with your hate I get it baby I get it as I'm up here oof 
oh yeah, and all this, all this is fake, all this is fake. You're listening to some crazy ass people who are fucking delusional, who don't have a fucking clue, who got some serious mental issues of their own, and they're telling you this, all this is fake. I've had people who've had people who died from COVID. Tell them, as they buried their loved ones, that that was fake. Tell them, as they bury their loved ones who died from COVID, that that shit was fake. I'm up here getting my, and my, ooh, my bones are burning like crazy right now because this radiation is just like tapping my ass, but I want to go outside so bad. And this is the rebellion in me that I have got to stop because I know better than this. He has taught me better than this. I have taught myself better than this. I know this is not the time to be rebellious on some stuff stupid shit. I know that I can't look at these trees, man. These trees are breaking down from something. Why are these limbs breaking down? They used to stretch up and now they're stretching down. Radiation tears up your integrity, but there ain't no radiation. Fuck you, motherfucker. Fuck you who's saying that because you're about to get some people killed behind your stupidity. And I find that hard. Oh, my turtles are back. Hey, baby. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. The synchronicities are in the house today. My turtles are back. Ooh, the choir is here. I just got to get this shit out. And then I'm going back into the house. Because you all are about to bring a side of me that you don't want to see. You better praise him. You better praise him because I'm a lot nicer because of him. Really, because of him. I'm a lot nicer because of myself too. Let me not put it all on him. I had to do the work. I had to do the work. I had to do the work. But he held my hand and walked me through it. It made me understand just who I am. I hate it that you don't have somebody like that in your life, but that's your fucking karma. All right. I've got it off my chest. Now I'm about to be about my best and do what I got to do for my rise, my elevation, my team. And y'all motherfuckers who ain't on it, stay off my dick.